Hello everyone, this is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to do a benchmarking test comparison between the Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra and the Honor Magic 7 Pro to see which device is going to be better in terms of hardware specs, daily usage and of course the benchmarking test score result. So here we go. So these are the benchmarking applications we got today here on our devices. We have already performed all of these tests and we will just have a quick look on the test score result. So first of all, let's start with Enter to Benchmark. So as you can see, the Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra has scored 2.663040 million points and Honor Magic 7 Pro has scored 2.719594 million points. So the winner is Honor Magic 7 Pro. If we go to the individual test score result here, you can compare the result of CPU, GPU, memory, and UX. And as you can see in CPU, memory, and UX, the winner is Honor Magic 7 Pro. And in GPU, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. The difference is kind of negligible when it comes to GPU and UX but our main concern is the overall score and in that the winner is Honor Magic 7 Pro. So let's go back from here to 3D Mark. So here in wildlife you can see both of these devices they maxed out but if you're talking about the frame rate the average range on Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra is from 102 to 184 fps while on Honor Magic 7 Pro, it is from 95 FPS to 177 FPS. So in terms of average FPS performance of Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra is better in wildlife. Now if you go to the wildlife extreme and this Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra is scored 6907 with 41.36 average FPS and Honor Magic 7 Pro scored 6495 with 38.90 average FPS. So in wildlife extreme as well. The winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. If we go to the Solar Bay, in this Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra scored 12,422 with 47.23 average FPS and Honor Magic 7 Pro scored 11,764 with 44.73 average FPS. So once again, in Solar Bay as well, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. If we go to Steel Nomad Light and this Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra scored 2509 with 18.59 average FPS and Honor Magic 7 Pro scored 2552 with 18.91 average FPS. So in Steel Nomad Light, the winner is Honor Magic 7 Pro, but in out of four tests, in three of them, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. So we can say that in 3D Mark, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. And now if you go to the Geekbench 6, this test is divided in CPU and GPU and the CPU test is divided in single core and multi core. So in single core, Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra scored 3071 and 9898 in multi core. While our Magic 7 Pro scored 3127 in single core, 9801 in multi core. So in single core, the winner is Honor Magic 7 Pro, and in multi core, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. If we go to the GPU test, in this Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra scored 19,630 and Honor Magic 7 Pro scored 18,121. So in GPU test as well, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. So in out of three tests of Geekbench 6, in two of them, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. So once again, we can consider it as winner. And out of these three tests, we got here and to Benchmark, 3D Mark and Geekbench 6. In two of them, the winner is Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra. But both of these devices are brilliant when it comes to hardware. Both of them are powered by the exact same processor. The only difference is that the one we got on Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra is slightly more optimized compared to the Snapdragon 8 Elite we got here on Magic 7 Pro. But this is just about the benchmarking test score result in real life performance, daily usage. You won't see much difference between these two smartphones. So it does not matter which one you are going to buy, you will be happy with the performance for sure. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching this video. If you found it useful, then give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe the channel and I will see you guys next time in another video. Have a nice day.